Hi cuties, popping in here real quick before the vlog to talk about the sponsor of today's video, which is Skillshare. Y'all know I've worked with Skillshare before and I love using it. Skillshare is an online learning community with tons of classes on different sorts of creative and inspiring endeavors. This time I decided to take a class about creating video on Instagram with a beautiful instructor named Hollies, and it really opened my eyes to different ways of creating content. As you know, this is what I do full time, but I think sometimes I can get stuck in a little bit of a pattern and it's nice to have a little bit of a refresh and I think that Skillshare is just a great way to invest in the tools in the toolbox. I feel like the older I get and the more people I meet, I'm always thinking to myself, I need more tools in my toolbox. And Skillshare is a really great way to do that because they offer really accessible classes that everyone can take on a wide variety of topics. So definitely would check the link down below. They're running a Black Friday, Cyber Monday deal right now so you can get 50% off an entire year subscription and make that choice to invest in yourself for the new year. I have nothing but good things to say about Skillshare. I am always so overwhelmed by how much you can actually learn and there's so many different topics that I would love to learn more on. Check the link down below. Let's get into the vlog. I don't know how I feel about this hat. <laughs> am I trying to do something that I can't get pull off? Hi, welcome back. Back from Austin, literal snow on the ground. It is Wednesday, November something. And I'm starting a new vlog. I'm on a roll. I'm really enjoying doing this and I love you all so much. Today is basically just a work day, I think for the most part. I gotta edit my Austin vlog, which you will have already seen. And just get back into the swing of things. I have a busy couple weeks coming up, so I need to just grind, baby. We're on our grind 10. Trying to stay on top of getting outside and exercising, even in the fall. So I'm gonna go hike Picoles. Here's what I'm wearing. Okay, let's go. How's it going? Good. Fun, fun, fun. Just being a little vlogger. <laughs> <laughs> Let's talk in a way that can give us some faith to go around. We'll hold tight as we can when it's better again. And that'll sustain me for now.
Thanks so much for, for coming up for the afternoon. And we'll see you again soon. Good morning. It's Tuesday morning. I woke up feeling pretty anxious this morning, and so I've just been trying to, I don't know, not be so hard on myself and just kind of ease into things. I think I'm just feeling a little bit stressed with work and things that are going on in my life. But uh, back from Vancouver, k Mobs was amazing. I got the set list, which is so amazing. Lots of eye contact. I really should start being at the very front of every show because it's quite the experience. And, anywho's, I'm gonna go get that framed. I also need to pick up a lot of things. It's my boyfriend's birthday on Friday, and I need to get some things together and run some errands. I also need to edit this video that you're watching, so just kind of a little bit of a busy day, and anxiety on top of that makes it a little bit hard to do things. I know, lots of people can relate. Uh, anyways, so yeah. Gonna go do that stuff. I also recently started using Poshmark. I'll put my account below. I decided I don't really like Depop that much because you have to worry about shipping and this is a lot easier in my opinion. So, so we'll be using Poshmark if you wanna check out some stuff there. I do donate most of my clothing or give it to my friends but there are certain things that just my friends either don't want or aren't interested in and I just feel like opening them up to a broader scope of people. Anywho's, okay, I've said anywho's like 10 times now. Hopefully we will make it through this day without having a little bit of a breakdown. Fingers crossed. Okay, super simple outfit today for my errands. Wearing these vintage 501s. I got a Victoria Vintage. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, my 530s. I've been wearing this Columbus, New Jersey crew ever since I got it in Austin. And what else am I wearing? My Aritzia puffer. This is the Mega Puff. And then thrifted bag. And that's it. This person has uh, two paper mache people in their car. And it scared the absolute living shits out of me. But I'm eating a burrito. I was eating it in there, but someone started coughing very aggressively. And I hope they are okay, but I am just terrified of getting ill. So I'm gonna finish my burrito in the car. It's typically my preferred place to eat my burritos anyways. Okay, just got back from all my errands, picked up a couple of Christmas gifts, birthday gifts. It's my boyfriend's birthday on Friday. 
I don't think he watches my videos. He's not supposed to, so. But I'm still, for safe measure, not gonna tell you what I got him. Actually, this will already be up. I got him a drill. An impact drill and a hammer drill. I think. But when we were at Kevin Mobes, K Mobes, my man K Mo, uh, my boyfriend kindly asked the sound guy to give me the set list. So I bought a frame today and I'm putting it in there. I've never received a set list from a show before. So I'm pretty excited about this. I am only mildly in love with Kevin Morby. Yeah, we had quite the special time. Have I already talked about this? I don't know. I also bought a new foundation brush today. Did I buy anything else for myself? Let me see. I got this number 64 brush, which is the brush I use to apply my cream blush, my favorite Tower 28 one. But I recently picked up, which is in the mail, hopefully we'll be here tomorrow, the Kozas um, foundation oil because I just want a little bit more coverage and something that is gonna make my skin look really dewy throughout the winter. I have really dry skin, so I thought this would be a good brush to apply it with because I actually really like this for my cream blush. So I thought maybe it would be good for that too. So I bought that today. What else can I tell you? I feel like a lot of people hate when I sit down and just talk about things I did instead of showing you. But right now I don't have anything. Oh, actually I don't need that stuff. I don't have anything to show you because my life is not very exciting half the time. Ooh, okay. I love framing things. I think when there's any opportunity to frame something, you should and put it on display in your house for everyone to enjoy. How do I put this in here? Is two pieces of glass? It is, okay. Fun. Uh, yeah, I really love framing things. <laughs> and I love going to people's homes and seeing fun things like a set list for a show that they decided to frame and put on display. Oh no, oh no, I made a big mistake. The tape from the backing to the frame just got onto the set list and is peeling off the set list. Words. These are like the little things that happen to me a lot. You know when there's like some unlucky things that just consistently happen to people? These are the sorts of things that they are. It's like always my fault that it's happening, but it still happens and it still ends up being really shitty. Like how right now the... I just lost some of the word before. The paper is ripping. You know what? It's okay. Can you see where before I got messed up? It's all good. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna cry about it. It's lucky that I even got the set list to begin with. I'm also happy to report that I'm feeling a lot less anxious now. I think just like getting some stuff done that I needed to that was on my to-do list has really helped me, you know, with that anxious feeling. I think I was just feeling a little bit overwhelmed. But it is now, I think it's, it's 4.02 and I'm just gonna get to editing my video. I think I'm gonna FaceTime with Tessa because I already miss her even though I just saw her. I miss my friends. I don't like living in different cities than them. Anyways, okay, I'll show you this when it's in the frame. <laughs> My love never had a hold on me But when she finally slipped away She left me bound